Okay, y'all, so I just did a video saying it was going to be my first and last review on Black Ink Crew. And then I went to Ashley Miller's page and I watched her review on the show because I refused to watch the show. And she said that the conversation at the end was like, it was just weird. Ryan was acting weird. So I pulled it up online and I literally went to like the last five minutes, pretty much like when they were sitting there at that table. Right. <sighs> Everything in that video that I said is everything is everything that, that was just proven in that damn video. Ryan, it's time to walk away from this. You are done with TV. You really said, okay, I'm, I'm going to give you your respect where it needs to be. I do agree a thousand ten percent that the way that stuff was on it before, it was not correct. It was incorrect. Shouldn't have been ran like that and y'all probably had to do something. But what you're not gonna do is sit at that table and throw a hissy fit like a five-year-old and compare yourself. Not even compare yourself, but you're gonna sit up there and say that when people was out there checking on four, it made you feel like, wow, what, wow, why is nobody checking up on me? Are you really trying to compare what you went through to what? four went through well you went through was self-inflicted you want to know how it was self-inflicted you was in a relationship you fucked another girl you got caught up on tv and in real life that's what happened how was anybody supposed to really come to check up on you what and just like ashley said if you never even made it known if you never even reached out for as we clearly see he reached out he was telling people look i'm not in a good space did you ever reach out to anybody did you even reach out to your best friend who was four so for you to sit at that table and throw a hissy fit i'm never here for lily but that her getting up from that table her getting up from that table though that would have been me because what i'm not gonna sit here and do is sit here right here you are a grown man you are a grown man ryan you're a grown man and you really sat at that table and threw a hissy fit like a five-year-old just like van said because it seems like you're still a little bit upset about shit that happened in the past and you won't let it the fuck go let it go ryan let it go get off of this damn tv because i'm so tired of you and you're sensitive as you are too freaking sensitive to be on tv take your losses and go somewhere else because i'm tired for the last two and a half seasons you have sat on this tv and blamed everybody me 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 nobody cares about me nobody cares about me when you got your stuff and you left and didn't tell anybody you was making moves and not telling anybody but all of a sudden we're all supposed to reach out no 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 Oh my gosh, that, shit, that just made me so mad. I swear this is my last thing on it. Like I said, I agree with the fact that y'all couldn't keep going the way that y'all was going. But Ryan, for you to sit up here at this table and number one, compare yourself to what four was going through. And then number two, to again, not take responsibility for what happened. I'm going to put it for you again, clear cut. You were in a relationship. You fucked somebody else. And then you got caught. That is the chain of reaction. That's what happened. I'm, I swear to gosh, I'm done. I'm done with the show. I'm done. I'm done.